Hey everyone, um, I have a lot of things to say about the Green Arrow, and I don't even know if the video is going to be able to, uh, be sped up. So, I have, I have a lot of things to say. Um, so let's just get right into it. The Green Arrow's secret identity is Oliver Queen. Uh, he is from Star City. He is a wealthy playboy and billionaire industrialist turned outspoken socially progressive politician. A show on the CW was created around this character. The show is called the uh, the show is called Arrow. But the story they gave him wasn't his original origin that was laid out in the comics. And if any of you have watched the show on the CW like I have, it's not the same origin story, so the one I'm going to tell you is the comic one that I got off of Wikipedia. So, thank god I put my glasses on because holy crap, there's a lot of words. Okay. He became a vigilante superhero who fights crime using his archery, martial arts, and technology skills. As a child, he idolized Robin Hood and was said to be a natural archer, frequently practicing with a bow and arrow. Oh, great, my speech is getting all wibbly wobbly. He was mildly traumatized the first time he accidentally killed an animal. His parents were mauled by lions in a tragic safari accident, and his hesitation to shoot cost them their lives. He was then raised by his uncle and grew into a rich, thrill-seeking, and drunken playboy with no real sense of responsibility or direction in his life. Everything changed when he fell off his boat in the middle of the ocean and washed ashore on the remote, isolated starfish island. He was clutching a bow, a moment, a memento, from a Robin Hood movie, which he had used to keep himself afloat where he was completely stranded. I read that completely wrong, but you get the point. During this time spent without food or shelter, Oliver developed his skills as a hunter to survive and gained mastery over his bow. Having taken everything in his life for granted, this experience taught him self-reliance and made him into a man. Oh, my speech. I am so sorry. His second test of new character was the discovery of drug smugglers on the island run by the ruthless international crime lord China White. Using his new skills, he attacked and destroyed their heroin operation, then delivered them to the authorities before returning home. Realizing that he had found his destiny, he chose to use his abilities and resources as a crime fighter. With a nickname coined by the press, he made it his mission to protect, protect Star City. He took his cue from Batman and built his own arrow cave, complete with an arrow car and allegedly a yellow submarine. He and Speedy fought with trick arrows that were designed to be non-lethal. And since I don't intend to make pixel art for Speedy, I'm just gonna give you a little bit about Speedy here too. Speedy, a young man named Roy Harper, idolized the Green Arrow. Harper was an incredible archer, having grown up on a Native American reservation. His mentor, Brave Bow, was dying and he needed someone to take care of him, so he wanted to become Green Arrow's sidekick. Proving his mettle by taking down several thugs faster than he could while they were both on the scene, Oliver adopted Roy as his legal ward. He would go on to fight crime, taking the name Speedy. Speedy would later team up with a number of other costume youths to form the Teen Titans, including Aqualad, Kid Flash, Robin, and Wonder Girl. And that is all I have for the Green Arrow and the little bit for Speedy. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one that will probably be Game of Thrones. Bye!